Bitcoin rising, Crocoin rising, crypto rising, and almost two trillion in global market cap. What a great time to be an investor. How are you doing, everybody? Welcome. My name is Oscar Ramos. And by the end of this video, I'm going to tell you the latest on crypto.com, the price analysis, predictions, and some news that as a Crocoin holder, you don't want to miss. Knowing that in the last couple of days, we're seeing the price of cryptocurrency rise, which is incredible. Knowing that Crocoin is not rising as much as other cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin or even BNB. Bitcoin at this time passing almost $43,000, BNB $400, and Crocoin still a little bit above the 40 cents. Of course, all knowing that ApeCoin exploded in the last couple of days. So even though we have Crocoin underperforming at this time what a great time to buy cheap once it's past a dollar we're gonna be making a lot of profit sit down relax and enjoy the show like subscribe and turn on those notification bells it's time to talk about crypto.com what you're seeing on the screen right now is the price of crow and well the stochastic error side the error side my fibonacci bollinger bands all of them indicate me right now that of course the price can go much higher I'm predicting that this is going to be a easily passing $1 cryptocurrency by the end of 2022. Possibly that's going to be more likely to happen as the time goes on. Knowing how many great things this cryptocurrency is adding to the repertoire when it comes to partnerships, when it comes to deals, when it comes to different crypto. And of course, the best thing that I like about this crypto is Kronos, their ecosystem, because I'm really involved with VVS Finance, Tectonic and MMF. And I think those protocols will really catch on on all the DeFi hungry community that's out there to find the highest APY APR. That is, I think, what Crypto.com is doing really well, the DeFi wallet and the opening the possibilities so you and I can make more money as we hold and stake. However, of course, we do want the main cryptocurrency Crocon to do well because that always puts us on top of the chart of the top buy market cap and that has everyone's attention on the cryptocurrency. But at this time, when we compare, for example, to Bitcoin on the four hour chart, having the Bollinger Bands here and the, and the, and the other side, well, Bitcoin is having the, top, the time of a lifetime right now at almost 43,000, which it did reach a couple hours ago. And of course, we are seeing some volatility knowing that in the Bollinger Bands, you know, it's kind of retracing back a little bit, but in the four hour chart passing this pink line, which is a nice, nice average that I have created for us, knowing that BNB Binance in the four hour chart, it's always, I mean, it's also doing really well at above $400. So what is the price of Crocon right now? 41 cents. Usually, Crocoin follows really closely the price of Bitcoin, and it should be around 42, 43 cents, but right now it's at around 41 cents. And in the four hour chart, the price that we have right here at the top in this red, which it means like the bullish, very hyper bullish price will be around 46 cents if it actually reaches by the end of this next four hours, which I don't think is going to happen, but I'm pretty bullish. We're heading there sooner or later. On the RSI, on the stochastic RSI, I see that we're still looking very well. I'm going to move this to a one day so you are seeing more clearly how we're still under that, that pink line, which means no, it's just been sideways trading ever since. I'm going to bring my market right now. Take a look at this. We haven't been able to leave this zone for a while, which is the, a little bit under 40 and passing 41, 42 cents. That's it. We had a nice pump here, but it came back down. So what's happening right now with crypto.com is not significant until we break and we touch, which is going to be right about, I'm going to bring the price here, right about 45, uh, 50 plus 55 cents. That's going to be significant for the day on uh, crypto.com and Bitcoin. Let's go ahead and move it to the one day right now. Bitcoin is getting closer at about, I'm going to bring my ruler. It has to jump about 10 to 15 percent to get past that pink line. And at that point, the price will be $47,000 right now, $42,000. So you see how it's less than 50 for Bitcoin, but for crypto.com to reach that pink line, that's about close to 60 cents. So that's where you see the difference on these two. But at this time, they're looking well and we're heading in the right direction. Binance really dominating the, the mark when it comes to the exchanges. But I mean, crypto.com right now, although we're not seeing a massive explosion, it's great that we're seeing some green candlesticks on 
Crypto.com. Knowing that the entire cryptocurrency market, guys, is almost two trillion, so that is great. Why don't we go ahead and refresh this for us? And it's going to be 1.93 yet, that almost three percent increase in the last in the last day. I think that's a great uh, it's a great win for all of us. Last 24 hours, we see Helium, we see Quantum, we see EOS, we see other different cryptocurrencies doing really well, and the ones that are not doing really well but by a margin of less than three percent so this is just that small correction this not means nothing honestly great job on the rest of these cryptocurrencies at this time fear still but i'm pretty sure by the end of the seven hours we're gonna see some neutral or less of a fear so we're gonna be extremely fine now here are the big news for us in crypto.com everybody that you need to know at this time we have great news says chronos news right take a look at this just a couple of days ago, 24 hours, Crypto.com has now greater volume than Coinbase Pro. That is not bad. That Coinbase actually. So this tells me that, okay, there's been a greater community on Crypto.com right now, specifically with the DeFi, and that makes a lot of sense. Although Coinbase is the main one used here in the United States, it doesn't have, it does have a stock. You can buy Coinbase stock, but it doesn't have that nice cryptocurrency that you can create a community around it. So it makes total sense. I think this was bound to happen, but it's really cool to kind of have it compare. Take a look at this one, everybody. Crypto.com is enabling the purchase of Time Magazine subscriptions via crypto. And of course, the new one is going to be ApeCoin, right? And ApeCoin now you can also purchase that through the crypto.com funnel at timemagazine.com, which is pretty cool. Support our journalism, become a time hold hodler. <laughs> They're pretty much kind of like tackling the cryptocurrency space, not pay with cryptocurrency, powered by crypto.com. And of course, they're missing the ape cryptocurrency right here because it was just recently launched and of course adopted by most of the different cryptocurrency exchanges. But now you'll be able to do that. Really cool. I mean, you guys know what happened last week. Everybody went crazy for it. We made videos. We had some commentary, but I knew it was going to come down. And thus far, $10 plus, it's right now going through. I'm still looking into this one. I think it's a great investment, but for the right price, right? Knowing everybody that still, I believe that this is what happened with crypto that come last week about opening more to their investors at the institutional level. This is huge knowing that there's just more people coming into the market and more big money like this one, world's largest hedge fund to invest in crypto. They're telling us in this article that they're not going to be putting so much money on it. It's going to be a tiny fraction of the more than 100 billion in management assets that they have. But still, having this from Crypto.com allows such big players in the game to put money on it. And I think that's something I really, really enjoy. So, being able to pay with ApeCoin, being able to pay with crypto, powered by crypto.com, that's always a positive in my opinion, right? Understanding that it is, it's going to take time, but at the end, this is, is going to be something pretty cool for us. And knowing that at the end of the day, our mark for a lot of people to say is, well, now we have crypto.com price. Now we have opening to ins institutional investors that we're even beating Coinbase at the volume level. So when are we going to finally beat Binance? This is going to take a while. First, crypto.com has to pass a dollar. I know there's so many predictions out there that it's going to pass $100, $50. Me, let's first pass a dollar and then let's have a conversation later. Passing a dollar, I think is a must, but it's going to take a while later for sure. Because guess what? Other different cryptocurrency exchanges are not slowing down. FTX invests 100 million in banking app. FTX, a plus to you too, is another great cryptocurrency exchange. So everybody, although we don't have the price of crypto.com at the level, we probably all want passing 50 cents or even beyond. I remind myself how incredible the Kronos ecosystem is right now. Even though at 10, we still have nine more people ahead of us. I mean, before Ethereum, of course, that, I mean, demand billions of dollars in total value locked. That still is going to take a while. And that's going to, of course, push eyeballs to look at Kronos and definitely come to crypto.com. So this is just like different ways as far as how crypto.com price can rise. But I think they're doing the right thing as of today with all these amazing partnerships and value propositions they're adding to their space. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on those notification bells, and I'll see you next time, everybody.
Peace.